It looked like a great summer job before starting college, but a Bellevue teenager learns she's the target of a scam and her savings may be gone. Mike McKnight has our story in this Fact Finders investigation. When it comes to child care, Jenna Boyd has experience in looking for more. Nanny in need, temporary, live in or live out. A Craigslist ad led to an offer. There were so many emails and so many everything, it was seemed legit. The emailer claimed to be coming to the Omaha area of a family to work on a contract with the EPA for private research. The EPA tells fact finders the agency doesn't hire for that and the email is highly suspicious. It looked good and it sounded good. That's Jenna's stepmom talking about a check prepaying the 17 year old to be a nanny. The scammer sent her an email saying buy some supplies for an apartment that the family would be moving into as soon as they get to the Omaha area. The check for almost $1,000, the emailer instructed Jenna to deposit it in her account, then wired nearly $600 to a landlord. The check bounced. And I like called my dad and Shannon and they were out of town and I was like, this is a scam. I was like, they took my money. It's rather irritating, you know, and I guess the thieves don't care. You know, they don't care who they're taking stuff from. When the scammers told Jenna to wire that money to a different person, she called Western Union just in time to get her money back. I was talking really fast. I was like, oh my gosh, I'm so happy that you're like able to do this for me. The 17 year old who starts college in the fall is relieved her savings built on babysitting money didn't slide into the hands of a con man. In Bellevue, Mike McKnight, WWT 6 News. You red flags could keep your teen from becoming a victim of this nanny scam. Watch out for checks from a company in one state with a bank in another and no phone numbers for either or if the check is for more than your wages and they want you to wire the difference. Also watch out for any person sending a check who only communicates by email and not by phone.